What is going on guys, today we are looking at the FC Founders number 2. So we have got another slot to thank you for being an FC Founder. It is going to be free to be able to do, which I think is the minimum. But the problem is, already looking at the favourites, I'm not a big fan. That looks not very good, to be honest, but we'll see. We'll, we'll post judgement. The best ones at the moment are Kolomowane, Openda and Sterling. We've got the max 85 overall, 94 pace, 80 shooting, 79 passing. So the 80 shooting already is quite low. So that's going to be a lot of base cards. We had a two overall, two pace, three passing, two dribbling, as well as the physical, three on this uh, shooting, and an extra skill move. The skill move is the only one that I'm like, okay, that's not terrible. So what players can we do? Obviously, Kola Moane would be a good shout. He has got a card already, which I am very interested to see because we've got the 84. Then we also have the 88 that can still be upgraded. But then we also have, obviously, that evolution. So 94 pace, 84 shooting. What skill move is he? He's a four-star, five-star. So we always oh, that been upgraded, in fact? No, so we would get a five-star skiller. Let's have a look at this card then. So we get five-star sk uh, skill move, four-star, 93 pace, 81 shooting, 88 dribble. I mean, that card most definitely. If, you are, if you've are, if you not got a top-end striker, that's going to be the perfect one. If, if, I'm being br if I'm being brutal for everybody else, I don't need to see anybody. That would be the number one. The five-star skills is going to be perfect. Sterling, I don't think he's even had a card before yet, has he? Has he, had, has he had anything? Oh, no, he has. He's had an 85 in form. So, we ba do we basically get that? Was it 86, did it say then? We get an 86 pound, and that's power shot. Uh, where do we go for... Where is the extra... There it is, found it. So, he does become 85, I was going to say. So, he does get the five-star, three-star. That's not terrible. The 87 pace, 87 dribbling, it just doesn't... It doesn't scream great for me. Like, we can already see we can get others. Yes, I know that obviously Power Shot was uh, paid for, so it is what it is with that one. But I do think when we've already got the 85 for 41,000, I wouldn't really want to waste my chance. At least with Kolo Mawane, that 88 is coming in quite expensive, I'm pretty sure. He's coming in at 490. So at least you are getting a pretty decent card. You're losing one pace, three shooting, two dribbling. If your team's looking like this, then I have the place for you. Head over to U7Buy for all your coin needs. They're cheap, fast, and reliable. But make sure to use JT11 at the checkout for 6% off all of your coin orders. It's not terrible. The only kind of difference at the moment is that Kolomowane can still be upgraded. Whereas, obviously, this one, that, that should be the final form. I thought that they were going to bring the foundations forward or the founders forward. So, for instance, I used Verna for my first one. I thought they were going to basically get him to be upgradable again as i'm pretty sure if you do the founders they are stuck in the founders i, I always thought that it would be like how the bronze was it the golden glow up one two i thought they were going to have a three and four that you basically take that card with you i thought that's what they'd do with the founders as well but apparently not if we're looking then keep on going we've got a pender he has got another card as, as the kind of other one he's got an 84 and then he's also got an 88 the 88 is a three-star, four-star, so you are missing out on that extra skill move. But, what are we looking at? 346. It's not, it's not a terrible... What, what do we get with the upgrade, then? Oh, okay. We're verifying, apparently. There we go. Uh, if we're looking at that, we get 95 on the pace, 82 shooting. It's a pretty standard card. Like, he's still only the 84, so you got to take it with a pinch of salt, because, naturally, you could have used him in multiple other evolutions, I believe. Uh, what is that one? 82. Level 4? Oh, is it just showing you what, what it looks like? I was going to say, I was like, hold on a second. Yeah, so that's the current line, so go to 83, then obviously to the 84. And he's, he's okay. I, I much prefer the other card. Yes, you'd get the 4-star skills with him, but I think I'd rather go with the Openda, uh, the, the Kolo Moane straight off the bat. If we've got anybody else, Havertz ha hasn't got a card yet. Would be a 5-star skiller as well. I'd say that would be a waste. I've already done Verna before, so we, we're not doing it again. malin has got a card that can still be upgraded. Felix has had an evolution. I'm pretty sure a lot of people put him in there. Anaki Williams has had an upgrade. Felipe and Anderson, how would he look? 84, 90 pages. Like I did Politano, so there's literally no point. So for me, the the 100% is going to be Carlo Moane, and I definitely say that would be worth it, 100%. We've got anybody else that I'm missing, because naturally, as you go down, you forget some of these players, but I can imagine if we go down to the 80s, 
there isn't really going to be anything like Watkins has got multiple evolutions and also informs Romarino. Their 79 is just too low. So for me, I think Kolo Moane is the biggest shout there. I believe that the actual evolutions is bugging at the moment. It hasn't popped up on my screen yet, but we will see it as it comes in. We don't even have the challenges yet, so we don't know what you've got to do. If it's anything like the other founders, normally it's going to be quite quick, which is nice. And that's it. I think definitely Goma Kolo Moane will be your best shout. Let me know down below what you think, though, and I'll catch you all for the next one. Peace.